It is very important to estimate how much water you'll need for irrigating your crops. This will guide you on the best pump to get so that your crops get enough water to grow well and you don't end up over pumping. Finding the right amount of water needed is difficult, so you'll need the help of an expert. Here is Mark Ben, an expert on the solar-powered irrigation system. There are scientific ways to go about it. There are tools which are available, including the GIZ SPIS toolbox, readily available online, and of course, engaging experts who can assist you to determine the crop water requirement. Extension services or local experts can do the exact calculation. Here's what they look at to work out the amount of water needed. One, crop type. Decide which crop you want to grow. Different crops need different amounts of water. Two, know the climate of your area. For example, if you live in a dry area, you will need more water than in a wet mountain area. Three, type of soil on your farm. Do you have light sandy soils or heavy clay soils? Four, irrigation type. Will you be using flood irrigation, a sprinkler, or a drip line? Different types of irrigation need different amounts of water. Flood irrigation is cheap, but uses a lot of water. The sprinkler is more expensive to buy, but it uses less water than the flood irrigation. But what we recommend, ideally, is a drip line system. And this is because of all the advantages associated with such a system, mainly our efficiency in water usage. The drip irrigation equipment costs more, but it is the best in terms of water usage. Because of the way the lines are laid out, water reaches the crop right away. This is the best irrigation type. What kind of system are you using now? I'm using the rain horse system and it uses a lot of water. And I can see the system is talking about uh, minimizes the cost and even the, the wastage of water because of the drip system. Next, the amount of water needed will also depend on the type of soil you have. With light and sandy soils, you will need to irrigate often using little water. With heavy clay soils, you will need to irrigate less often but using more water. You should also avoid runoff of water on the farm and make sure water does not collect. It is best to irrigate in the morning hours when the sun is low and the soil is not heated up. This way, the water won't evaporate as quickly as when the soil is hot. That is why it's a good idea to get a water tank where the pumped water can be stored while it is sunny and used in the morning.